And right now at 5, the Milwaukee County Medical Examiner working to identify a body found at the scene of a fire. But that body was not found by firefighters until the day after the blaze. Bruce Harrison is live near 26 in Greenfield. And Bruce, what have you learned about how this happened and how firefighters missed it? Charles Carroll, around a half dozen neighbors and business owners in this area tell me for years they've seen a kind older man come and go from this alley, often pushing a cart of random items to this warehouse back here. They're now afraid that he's the one who was found dead just behind that garage door. On Tuesday afternoon, crews seen putting out the fire, but it wouldn't be until the next day that someone else, not the fire department, found the body of a 70 year old man. The fire department says during its initial response, discovering the body was nearly impossible due to hoarder conditions. Chief Aaron Lipsky tells me their on-site investigation is complete and they're reviewing all actions internally. Hi, this is Bruce Harrison at TMJ4 News. How are you? An employee of the building's owner says they leased the space as a warehouse. We later ran into more employees Thursday as they prepared to enter the boarded up building. How you doing? Can I just ask you what you, what you guys are planning on doing in there? Evaluating it to clean it up. Oh, right on. But they never opened it and drove away. The fire department hasn't said what started the fire. Last year, Milwaukee Fire apologized after failing to discover a body in a burnt out car. Chief Lipsky says they failed to protect human dignity that day. We have to do everything we can to prevent them. There's still a lot more to piece together on this one. The medical examiner says they have yet to identify the body or locate any family. We'll keep you updated. Charles, Carol? Yeah, a lot of questions around this one. All right, Bruce, thanks.